the process for conducting a uh, Pennsylvania legislative history for laws that were passed before 1975 is a essentially a three-step process. The first step is to locate the act number for a piece of legislation. To do this, if you're looking in Purdens, at the end of each statutory section, you'll see a citation for a law that was passed. It'll give the year, the date it was passed, the pamphlet law number, which is in effect the page number within the laws of Pennsylvania for that year, and then finally, the act number. So for an example, a citation giving act number 82, passed in the year 1973. We'll go to the second step, translate that act number into a bill number, which you do by looking on the first page of an act that's printed in the laws of Pennsylvania. So I would go to the 1973 version of the laws of Pennsylvania and uh, numerically by act number 82 and look at the first page of act 82 and I will see the bill number, either a House or a Senate bill, in this case, Senate Bill 492. Then finally, my third step, I will take my Senate bill number and find the, uh, find the uh, remarks in the House or Senate journal. So I will initially consult the House or Senate histories for 1973. And I will locate Senate Bill 492, which is uh, listed sequentially. So Senate Bill 492. And I will scan the histories and I will see a mention of remarks in the Senate journal on page 459 in 1973. So finally, I will go to the I will go to the Senate journal, page 459 for 1973, and I will find some remarks that were made on the Senate floor pertaining to my piece of legislation that I'm interested in. For acts and laws passed after 1975, I can go to the uh, Pennsylvania General Assembly's website from the uh, legislation enacted page, find my act number, and then click on the history link at the top of that page. So the General Assembly website, legis.state.pa.us, uh, click on legislation enacted since 1975, Let's say I was looking for a 1975 piece of legislation. They've got the legislation listed by act number. They've already translated into a Senate bill number. So if I was interested in the history for Senate Act 1, Senate Bill 30, I'd click on the uh, Senate bill link. And then I could click on the history link. And then my history page here for the bill will lead me to remarks in the House Journal. Click on that page number, and here we go. We get a PDF scan of the Legislative House Journal right there. So in a nutshell, that's uh, legislative history for Pennsylvania. If you have further questions, please contact the Information Desk. Thank you.